At Hofstra, and that is a punishment of its own. And swearing is half the swear rate. I what? Uh, it's kind of going off right now. Yeah, he's uh definitely running away with it, as the kids say. Is that what the kids say? I believe it is. I could be, I could be mistaken. I've also never been. That was really nice. Cool. Dare I say? So this is game two. Of Grants. It seems like Fahrenheit. I'm not going to say he takes a while to download, but he goes for a very secure download, is what I'll say. Like, he wants to have all the details. You know what they say about the details, the devil is in them. Are you saying Mr. Fahrenheit is possessed by the devil? <laughs> Are you implying... Not saying that? anything. You're just stating a fact. Whoa. I don't know what that means. Uh, what? Oh, nice parry. You know, I, the thing I really like about Roy is it doesn't matter if you read the option correctly, because if you touch them, they die. Yeah. Ooh! No! That Wait, is... Yeah, that... That's valid. That's legally valid. Why did that work, though? Can you DI that? Probably. Allegedly, gameplay is happening, and I'm not sure I'm convinced. I don't know what that is. I don't know what, what? you are. Who? Oh. Who are you? Who do you think you are? I am. Gameplay at Hawthorne. Come on, no freestyle. No. No, we, we have a match to commentate. Oh, uh, he down throw it into two up there. So uh, yeah, he almost was done. Good up. Oh, he's, I think no. No, he's safe to jump. Fahrenheit's safe. Fahrenheit's like a like a guy playing baseball who makes it to home plate and is not out. I don't understand that, right? I'm a gamer. I don't pay attention to mainstream sports because I'm above them. No, nothing really separates the sports and sports and sports. Except for sports being exactly done. What? Oh my god! He's grabbing him, carrying him like a suitcase. Grabbing him like one of Wait. Yeah. That is amazing. He's just running away. You should be able to grab someone and tumble. I'm sorry, that's bad. What? They should give Sheik an air grab. I agree. Bowser no, already, no, you don't. Actually, no, Bowser already has that. I don't want it. I just take, take it off of Bowser and give it to Sheik. <gasps> nice. What is going on? He's going deep. It's what's happening. Ooh. It's really interesting. It seems like Fahrenheit is not playing like he's at all threatened by being off stage or near the ledge. It's really cool to see someone with a character, you know, with a character considered. What are these? These are. The How do you do these? <gasps> Oh! It's the knee of justice, Justin. It's the knee of Justin, Justice. Something in my head said he was dead there, and I'm glad that's not what happened. It's going for the fancy, fancy reverse. Yeah. Might be a Mr. Fahrenheit or Fatality. That's it. Those are your two choices. You know, I find it interesting that his. Yeah, Captain Falcon's jab is such a non-combo tool given everything else about him. 
I thought he was going to land into a knee. I was going to cry tears of rage. Oh, the double spot dodge. Catching an option that was never brought out. It's good just in case. No, the sword was away! I'm away. Set my, mind space right set my status is not disturbed. And what there's the knee! That? I can't even do falling up there to save my life. That's stomp knee, baby. <gasps> that sent at such a bad angle for him. One on earth. Is that a back throw? No, that was um that was down tilt. I fully expected him to just get grabbed and throw him backwards and have a kill, to be honest. He landed That's dead. Real. Uh, this could potentially be turned to stock, but this man is at 140. No way! Showing no fear around the Dancing Blade, and I think that's part of how you've got to beat the Dancing Blade. It's just, you can't be too scared of it. No. You need a healthy amount of disrespect. You just need to pretend it's not there. You just need to get hit by it, and lose the stock, and then try again next game. I hate that. <laughs> Me too. But that's okay. But that's okay because I'm playing Pokemon Go at the train station. So talk to me about Steel. Why is he so round? Yeah, he's so round. He's round. He's very and the rando counter. The Hofstra counter. Trademark. By guess out. He really did. I kinda like um I'm not biased. But but you're rooting for it. No, I hate Captain Falcon. You do? I hate Captain Falcon so much. Why? I don't care about him in Ultimate. In Smash 4, he was the worst character ever to play against, and I'm so sick of him. I That's don't fair. want him in video games. That's fair. I, I hope that. they never make another. You can't swear. If we're not even streaming. We're recording, and it's going to go on the YouTube. This is not even live. I'm, I'm gonna censor you. Like, come on. No, we don't edit them. Yeah, Justin. no, I've always been careful about things. You know that? No, I despise him. Dang. Interesting. The more you know. Oh my God! Going platform to platform. Call that international Take travel. Hit to hit, rocking through the wilderness. That's a much better song reference to put it there. <laughs> I don't know about that. It was better than just saying and call that international travel. <laughs> <laughs> Traveling, this isn't basketball. Speaking of travel, he's getting a lot of mileage on his hits. And walk off knee. On, on the one hand, I think knee is kind of neat. On the other hand, I think it's just crits that you can control, and that's dumb. It's like every character who had a better upper than Zero Street in the Smash 4 just. Yeah, he always pissed me off when everyone complained about it. It always pissed me off when everyone complained about that crap. Because it's like Mario and Captain Falcon did the same thing but better and we didn't cause any crap. It feels like. Everyone's always like, oh, Captain Falcon's so hype. Captain Falcon's so cool. I hate Captain Falcon. It feels like uh, people are just averse to dying off the top for any reason. Like they feel robbed if it happens. Going deep for it. Is that an F tilt? I want to say that was an F tilt. I'm in a blender, yeah! You know, Alphanon's doing a really, really good I'm job. I'm not disrespecting this Fahrenheit right now, for the record. I don't even think Captain Falcon's like an especially good character in this game. He's playing great. Yeah, <laughs> just for the record. For the record, not a problem. calls me out. And there's the back air. Makes it back just barely. I don't know if the jump uh, saved him, or I don't know. I really have no clue, but I guess, was really good. I guess it saved him because it made it so he was out of tumble before he hit the top last zone. Is that throw going to kill him? Again. Makes it. Just barely. Dude, See, how uh, are you ready for that? I can't... I can't even fathom, like... Oh, he air dodged? I missed my option. I guess it's time to do the next option. Like, item. Is it 2-2 is it two, two now? Yeah. I think so. Okay. Scary. I say. How many wins was that for? Is it 2-2? Two, two? Oh yeah, it's reset. It's not one. The bracket just reset. Right? Oh yeah, so I guess... It's 0-0, oh, oh, right? It's 0-0, oh, because oh, he just reset it. Alright. 1-0? One, oh? No way. Go! Interesting. 
This horizontal aggression is really on point. It's scary. Dancing play. It's, uh, it's like a choose your own adventure book where you survive all of the endings instead of walk down the stairs and fear insolence God smites you. This is boring. Don't say that. Why? I will say, it seems like these are both really, really explosive characters. And uh, they both terrify me. They're both back air. They have nice Corey. fire effects in all their moves. More firefighting <laughs> types. Awesome. Oh, nice up. I didn't um, actually think I was going to kill. Yeah, I, I want to hazard some imperfect up B. Or it's up B. What? DI. There's the one I'm looking for. But I don't know. <sighs> Feels like these just characters are taking turns blowing each other up. It's concerning, dare I say? In my heart of hearts, I saw that hitting, and that was concerning. I could escape from that. I forgot Roy has a kill Nair. That's terrifying. Is that a trait that all the swords have? I'm actually not kill Nair. Um, not really. Just they can kill off stage, but then I kill you. Unless you're Roy. Well, yeah. Interesting. God, that's so much! I mean, Chill. especially not if you're part of it, because I don't tip for that move. Yeah. Really, all of that? And there's the knee. Characters are uh, equally close to dying. That fact is terrifying. I'm really shocked that they didn't kill, actually. Yeah, one, I think it's one very major thing. There it is. Being above Roy is the worst mistake you can make. But it's also the worst mistake you can make because it's not a mistake you make voluntarily. It just happens to you. I agree. And then you Roy die. Roy sure is a man with a passion. For fashion. I don't agree with that in any capacity. He wears gold armor and a red helmet. Stop the battle! Uh, I don't know. Got a passion for people. Roy is economically a bad guy, uh, as far as I'm aware. <laughs> economically sick and twisted. I love that part of uh, Fire Emblem, uh, whichever one he was in, where he betrays his whole army and goes into killing people again. Yeah, that's yeah that thing that happens in all, all of the Fire Emblem. Yeah, that's all the lords do that. Yeah, it's like uh, in Modern Warfare, the obligatory turret sequence in every, every Call of Duty game. Every Fire Emblem game is that moment where your main character goes on a murderous rampage against their own army. Yeah, the trademarks, by the way. Yeah. Well, that's why no other games have featured betrayal since uh, the release of the first Fire Emblem. No game since. I do believe that ending is uh, in a uh, in copyright. spoilers for uh, the original Knights of the Old Republic game. Uh, one of your party members like switches sides like for the last area. It's really. Interesting. Yeah, so like that character that you can the time becomes evil. It's pretty interesting. It's like build up too as well. Are we gonna see some build up? Uh, <laughs> no, it's gonna come out. I mean, unless you consider like this build up. What? No, 
is it up or uh the spear? <laughs> cool. I don't think you think it's cool. Well that's also I don't Nair shouldn't do that. Yeah, why would first hit Nair send you up, like in any capacity? Um because he's hitboxing and he's not quite cool. Well that's not even a hitbox, that's just physics. No, 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 because the angle is set with the hitbox and it's like first hit really? sense like that. Yeah. So hitboxes are all coded with like a half dozen of and that's the same thing on the partner. So it's damage, face knockback, knockback growth, face knockback, which usually says it's kind of neat. Yeah. So, why so is hitboxes that? have their own angle. Yeah, each of them. Well, I don't. Okay, so maybe it needs to do that to combo into the second hit. No, the second hit's higher. But there's auto link angles. Just okay. stuff that makes it sign the second hit, like make hit one hit two. Nah, not sure. I think this needs to. I mean, maybe like restricting that is actually just making it easier. Like, yeah, I guess maybe the second hit's too strong and they need it to not be too hard when you don't. Yeah. I beyond me, frankly. Inspection. That was almost horrible. Yeah. That was the scariest thing I think I've ever seen. Like, I don't know if there's um, DI involved in that to get out of up air, up or knee. Like, it's just pretty consistent. There it is. Um, I almost want to say up and out, I don't know. Boy, that wind is a fierce battle. Interesting. I think he whipped that. What do you flip? I think he probably flipped. Did they just go back to the stage they lost? I don't understand that they're right the now. I don't know what either of these characters want out of a stage, to be honest. Yeah, well, I kind of know what Roy wants. I don't think Roy. I think Roy just wants Three, to two, one, yeah. go! I don't know how the platforms would be and I don't know how they benefit Falcon. Um, I guess. Not like, it feels like. Yeah, I'm just kidding. But like they go to the stage and they just toss them stab them multiple times. Yeah. So obviously they're picking it for a reason. Yeah, I mean I guess I think some players try to switch things up when they lose, and I guess these players just want to run it back basically. Uh that was unfortunate. That was a weird knee. Trading with knee almost never goes well unless you're like unless you're super armor and you're a negative and a large brain. Yeah. And are uh backed up by third level nine C Six shields. They're getting hit by uh they're laughing, so clearly someone's having to this game. <laughs> um gameplay? There. Yep. Dump. Pressure platforms. Jab. Ah. I the speed of this a little bit uh trouble. Oh. Yeah. It's really cool. I, I know if the camera gets the point, but these are two explosive characters, two explosive players. At least comparing to not one like And just uh, things just kind of happen, and you gotta deal. What percentage? Uh, certainly not high. Focus. No, it was pretty high. Was it? Okay. He was above 100. Was oh, never mind. High. Yeah. Okay. Scary, dare I say. Just, um, like, <laughs> command grab up bees are a little intimidating. I, I think all the I agree. Yeah. I mean, the side B ones are more egregious for multiple reasons. Yeah, I mean, he also was like the original. Yeah. Like, you know, don't take away his. Yeah, he's got it dead to rights, it says. They should give one to Roy. Deep to a bit, making it bad. I just think, like, command cards in a game where you don't need to worry about, like, high low necessarily for blocking. They're just, like, they're really good. Yeah. This is, this is, you get hit by it. It's not like you block a certain way and you beat it. Or, like, it's not your slow but generalist option. It's just you hit by it. You lose to it. You shield it, you lose well, to it. Also, a lot of them are, are like. Okay, oh, that's it. That's tournament. There it is. You got him with the forward tail. That's, that's happened so many times. We're just talking about like mechanics, and then the game just ends. I like to. Roy should just have one move where he just decks you. That should be a side B. Side should tail be, should be a shoulder check, because like that man's got big. Side B plates. should be a command grab, where he grabs you, pats you gently on the shoulder. 
Fire Emblem dialogue comes up. It's all of his lines from his home game. All of, all them. of them. All of them. They come in really fast, though. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. It's like a Star Wars title crawl. Um, in, the <laughs> Star, in the Star Wars font. And then he just punches you and die. Instantly. 999 damage. Unless you're at zero, in which case you take 999 damage. <laughs> the Star Wars being so There's the clap. I was kind of waiting on that. That's Grands, though. Grands, baby. Roy grabs you, puts a hand on your shoulder. Game pauses, Star Wars theme begins, text scroll going, background disappears. Um, a random Star Wars movie starts playing, but every cut is from a different Star Wars movie. And then it zooms Every in. time the camera cuts, it's a new movie. Yeah, correct. Um, and then it ends in a video of Crazy Frog breakdancing. <laughs> and then Roy dies, but he dies after the other person. Roy comicizes. Yeah. That's dark. I got hands on my Are we hands. interviewing the winner or should we cut the recording? I think we should cut now. Okay. Justin, thank you for commentating. Okay, I apologize. What? Oh, all good. No, it's not. Okay. Well, I'm sorry. it's not. Uh, thank you for tuning in. Pizza time. Don't forget to shop at... Where are we shopping? Target. I like Target. Can we legally do that? I like Target too. Wait, hold on. Is this, <laughs> is this legal? Uh, 